man, OBS reconnected. Are we back? I'm assuming we got a little disconnected. It is what it is. So I'll just let, uh, let me make sure this is, let's kick it up to the proper resolution on this guy. So I'll do my little salutations uh, because the odds are we got knocked out, OBS disconnected. Uh, so gang, I'm Chicho. Welcome to our live stream. Today, today is August 17th, 2023. Oh God, F, beat F. What's up, Chicho? Uh, Lions, I already read that. Crash, oh no, it's crashing. Hopefully it's not crashing. It says it kicked up again. So I deleted, uh, I deleted the uh, kick. Okay, it should be back. I'm seeing ourselves streaming. I'm seeing your crash comment here, over here, over here somewhere. Okay. Uh, so gang, uh, welcome to our live stream. Um, August 17th, I took uh, uh, about 10 days off, went to a nice little festival um, in Headley, BC. We're back, Beastman says. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, went to a nice little uh, three-day festival uh, in Headley, BC, near uh, Princeton or Soyuz. Nice and hot desert climate. It was like 30 something degrees, a little river there, dunked on the liver, uh, river once and danced uh, a fair bit. There was music going from 11 a.m. until 3 a.m. So pop, 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 whatever that is, that's 12, 12 plus four. So 16 hours of music a day. Um, fantastic time. Great time. My partner played one set. Um, there was a couple of stages. Uh, so I had a very good time. Uh, but took a little bit of effort getting there, took a little bit of effort coming back. Emersonic, what a lovely surprise. Hope everyone's having a good week. Awesome, awesome, Emersonic. Welcome, welcome to our live stream. Gang, I'm going to pour ourselves a drink. Check this out. I've been drinking Hoin beer, a local brewer, brewery on Vancouver Island. And they put out this new beer. I haven't tried this one. Appleton's finest British ale. I haven't tried this one. Okay, so I don't know what this is going to be like. It's the same brand. Uh, the other, every other brand they put out has been delicious. I haven't seen this label, and I don't know what Appleton's finest means. I'm assuming that's something in the UK. Uh, British ale. I'm assuming Elder God and those of you in the UK will know what this is uh, referring to. Uh, I'm assuming it's going to be delicious, just like the rest of them. Oop. Just like the rest of them. So let's crack this open. Get ourselves ready. And then we'll do our little intro because um, well, we won't be able to upload this full live stream to SensorTube. But we'll try our best. Snack. I'll show you the snacks. Oh, got good snacks. Berries. We got berries of snacks. It's darker, eh? Nice. Check this out. We're just going to give it a little bit of head. Okay, not much. Let's see this thing. Ooh. Mmm. Smells, uh... Smells sweet. Sleepy Waves, how you doing, Chicho? It's been a long time since I've been able to join. What's up? Doing good, brother. Welcome, welcome. Salute, gang. Oh, nice. It's got a little bit of bitterness to it. It's actually got more bitter to it than the dark ale. Nice. Nice drink. These guys haven't disappointed yet with their beers. Let me put this guy here. Check out our snacks. Let me show you our snacks. Hopefully we're still streaming. Doink. Let's check it out. Yeah, we're still there. Awesome, awesome. And we're still on Rumble. Very good, very good. Very good, very good. I'm not sure if the notification goes out on Rumble or not. Check out the snacks. We got some blueberries, right? It's berry season, gang. This is unsprayed blueberries uh, that we'd like to pick up. Okay. 
Uh, unfortunately, regular blueberries, they spray a lot of pesticides on them. These ones are unsprayed. Very good. And the smaller berries, from what I understand, have higher, um, whatever the thing is, the blueberries have, um, they got more nutrients. Okay. Now check this out. Blackberries and strawberries. Again, strawberries from RCSA, organic strawberries that they grow, that they bring us, right? And the blackberries there, we went picking about two days ago um, at a spot that we have for picking blackberries. Phenomenal. These are the blackberries we're going to use to um, make jam tomorrow. I <laughs> can't get the thing to focus. There you go, right? Phenomenal blackberries. One of the best blackberry uh, seasons we've had, right? So good, so good. Mr. Robotope, how are you doing? Uh, do seeds get sprayed? Uh, I don't know. Blueberries do. Uh, the blackberries aren't. These are just um, area that we know, a patch that we know, a big patch that we just found this year, actually. Amazing. Really good. And these strawberries are not sprayed. Okay. <laughs> They're still a little bit tart. They're not as sweet. Okay. Cheryl, how are you doing? So really good strawberries. Right, delicious. We have some strawberries growing as well. So I've been munching our, our strawberries a little bit better this year. Okay. Very good. And the blackberries, phenomenal. We picked six buckets of these. We're going to go pick more next week. Okay. We're going to go pick more next week. Very good. So good so good um blackberry season is amazing um summertime for me one of the things i associate summer with is blackberries okay so i love blackberries elder god how you doing i am here i can't connect to twitch at the moment oh you can't connect to twitch elder god oh how come oh well you're on rumble <laughs> you're on rumble good thing we're live streaming on two platforms right Amersonic. i was in the isle of mall this week and the blackberry bushes there were just starting to ripen so good so good and this is the blackberries we got it was really hot like really it was crazy hot and i got a system for blackberry picking is really good right i wear uh, construction gloves on my left hand grab um vines not vines i guess uh, i guess they're vines uh, lift them up and pick with this one and I got bucket sitting around my neck so we me and my partner were able to pick uh, six buckets eight buckets actually but then they settle so went into six buckets uh, of um, <laughs> Via was about to catch something or Sal was about to catch something uh, so and we did it in two hours and it was really good right but this was the first batch there was lots of red ones still there. So we're going to go picking next week as well. So we might do an, another uh, jam, blackberry jam as well. Elder God's finally on Twitch. Awesome. Pourquoi? How are you doing? Looks amazing. How will you keep all these buckets of, uh, of blackberries? We put them all in the fridge. I made room in the fridge. We put them in the fridge. Tomorrow we're going to make jam, blackberry jam. Right? We're going to keep one bucket for eating. Okay. Until next week. And then next week, we're going to go pick again and uh, keep on rotating. If there's more being ready, we're going to keep on doing it, right? Uh, I want to make a lot of jam. I want to make a lot of blackberry jam. Uh, and then we put some in the freezer as well. So during the winter, we have some blackberries in the freezer. We're actually going to have one bag of blackberries in the freezer that we're going to use tomorrow in the jam making as well. I just got to remember to use it up, right? Um, 
Homeless robots. Salutations, salutations. Welcome to our live stream. Why are blackberries never lonely? Because they hang around in bunches. Ha 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 ha. Salute, salute. Yeah, blackberry jam is is amazing. We're trying to make a strawberry jam as well, um, but the f local farm that we get the strawberry beds from, um, they said they had some kind of uh, bugs in their flower, so they didn't get enough. They're not getting enough strawberries, uh, so because they don't spray, right? So they haven't had any nice flats available yet. Okay sometimes mike how are you doing quick jump in to say salutations have a great day sir you as well mike you as well and gang do not forget do not forget free assange free assange free assange julian assange is a publisher and journalist that has been crucified for trying to bring transparency and accountability of capital as power to humanity for more information see wikileaks.org Defend.wikileaks.org or countless resources available on free speech platforms. Okay. Mr. Ropito, what's going on with the with the rumble? It's uh, a ruble is tanking, which surprises me because my understanding has been that Russia is doing quite well despite the Western narrative. Yeah, Russia's economically has been doing phenomenal and uh, it's it's dropping. But I think it's uh, being manipulated to drop by uh, the Russian Central Bank and Russia in general. Uh, the Duran's done a pretty good job of it. Uh, one of the reasons it went down was because uh, oil prices had dropped down to around the 60 range, right? 65 range or so. Now oil prices kept kicking up. You, The ruble most likely will kick up as well, right? So I'm expecting ruble to stabilize around the 80 uh, to 90. Uh, range right Cheryl I'll bl our blackberries have been uh, done for a while but our late raspberries are coming in already and on really your blackberries are done oh interesting our raspberries came in early uh, so we had lots of raspberries like in the neighborhood we're not growing any uh, so I know there was raspberries so munched on a little bit um, I don't have any raspberry bushes that I go to to pick, but our blackberries are coming in hard now. Pourquoi? Will you tell us more about meeting at Tamara Lynch? I will. I will check this out since you brought this up. Here, let me write up the cigar. And this is uh, Vigueros. This is the type of crappy label Canadian government is forcing Cuba to put on the Cuban cigars because they don't want design beautiful art labels to be on the cigars right so cuba has built up a factory in cuba to put these crappy labels on cigars that are going to canada right so this is a vigueros check this out vigueros what's it called mananitas cuba right and then what you can do is just take off this crappy draconian label and you get the vigueros right this is the cuban label right vigueros Okay, so this is what we're going to smoke. I'm going to light this up. And then I'm going to show you, tell you about meeting uh, Tamara Litch. And I went and saw her uh, two nights ago. Uh, she was giving a little talk and a little interview at a local church that was the center of resistance to draconian uh, COVID lockdowns right and we used to go when it was underground they told people not to bring cell phones tracking don't park near long story if we've talked about it but she was giving a presentation there she was part of the truckers uh, uh rally organizers right and here's check this out so we went and saw her okay and here's pictures i loaded up pictures uh but pourquoi very like it, it was amazing meeting her so this is here let me show you this is this is me meeting Tamara Litch, right, uh, two nights ago. Okay, I took a picture with her, right? <laughs> Can you tell I was happy as fuck? <laughs> right, very proud. I was teary-eyed, really. I was teary-eyed. She is a firecracker, firecracker. She, I, proud, proud Canadian, 
right? Uh, she stood up against bullies, the likes of which uh, society hasn't really seen or see, sees very often, right? Um, it, and it, 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 talk to her a little bit. Uh, and she, she said, uh, tyrants, she doesn't, she's never uh, succumbed to tyrants and always stood up against bullies. Uh, and like, and she saw bullies trying to bully Canadians and she had no choice, right? And then, uh, so this was before the talk, we took a little picture, right? Um, and then, oh, hold on, let me do this, let me do this. This is, uh, I, there was a huge lineup of books, people buying her books. Here's a book, right? Check this out. Here's a book, all right? So I bought, <laughs> people were buying one or two, right? I bought five of these books, right? One of them signed to me, Chicho, right? The other four, I got her to sign to, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you. <laughs> let me show you, let me show you. And I put them bags and boards because I want to make sure. Check this out. I got, a, I got her to sign it to Chichonian, to our community, stay strong and free, right? Tamara Lich, right? So there's four of these books that we're going to give, uh, we're going to give two away this year uh, in our yearly auction, right? For Twitch to the community, right? So, uh, yeah, auction all the way out to God, right? So I was like ha happy as fuck, right? And then, uh, like so i was telling her in this picture up up here i was telling her how to spell chichonian because she had signed one uh, for chicho right and then uh sort of got up got up g gave me a hug right the shiny book is mine oh my god she got up and gave me a hug right and then the, the, i gave her a hug i was starstruck sir. not starstruck but just fucking in her presence when you're talking with her she was looking you in the eye always like when i was talking with her like i got i got choked up i couldn't really say too much because i was uh, i was choked up right and then uh, took it like like you can see i'm flush red just so happy so happy and happy for our community so we got these books that uh, two of them we're going to give away this year one the following year and one more the following year after that i guess so we're going to do this for three years give it uh give it away so i'll have one book and our chichonian community will have uh, uh whoever whoever gets it you look like giant <laughs> she's so small <laughs> she's like a little firecracker man I... we're in a battle we're in a war right and there is no one I would rather, no side I would rather be than hers. Okay. Like, really. She, this is, these are the types. Of, I, I went up to her. I said, you're a true warrior. Right. Like, there is no other word for her. And you should have seen the, the people that came up and said how much she had inspired them. Um, that the movement became global. Uh, one guy came up, and just poured out his heart, right? Like the whole audience, it was like, I don't know how many people, the, the church was packed, a lineup to get the book signed outside the church, right? Like it, it, she was there for hours. I went up to her and said, listen, I'm going to be really quick. There's a huge lineup of people wanted to get the book signed. And I know you know you're very tired and those people want so he, here's this here's this and uh the, the, like incredible incredible so i was very proud very proud and very happy to have these okay very happy to have these uh so that's me telling my story about me meeting tamara lich and if she comes back again i'll skull go see her again and again and again and again right fantastic fantastic amazing really uh, even get choked up now right even get choked up now okay Ch Cheryl we have 
uh, early raspberries in June, then blackberries in July. Our late raspberries usually don't start ripening for a couple of weeks yet. Oh, I think your spring drought drew things. Oh, that's what it did. <laughs> Shiny oligarch. I swear, like my my partner was going you're gonna get five i go yeah i gotta get it for joining community like the, like no choice about this oh we gotta get this all uh, right it's just like the uh the record we got so, like something precious like we get uh, if i can get it multiple copies for me i, I get for you guys as well uh. <laughs> Cheryl, I get that way when I meet people I admire. I'm fine right up until I try to speak. Cheryl, fuck. <laughs> right? I would, uh, really, I got teary-eyed inside when she was talking. Because she was getting teary-eyed. She cried a few times. Right? Uh, not uh, cried because she was under stress or anything like this. She cried because she understood. Um, she, she still is going through the process of processing what she represents and what she meant for people right incredible incredible right Pourquoi? what a great idea you had getting these books for the auction yeah yeah for sure uh, like it, it, it was sort of in the auditorium I was going oh wow what if they don't have any books I want to get a book cop assigned for me and I went wait a second maybe I should have gone to the store and bought books and I was like no they my partner was like no no, no. we want to buy the books here because she gets you know they get the money directly and stuff like this I said oh yeah 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 I hope they have books oh wow oh, I was all a little paranoid and then uh, when we get into the lineup I checked my pocket I go, how much money do I have <laughs> So it's like, oh, I hope I, I spent all my money there buying these five books, right? My partner grabbed two, one for herself and one for someone else. Okay. It, it was amazing. It was fantastic. It was a burst of energy. Inspiring. Inspiring. Really, really. Oh, my God. Uh, says she is five feet in some size, some five, seven, and no, five feet. She's five feet, grandmother, matey, uh, firecracker, right? Alberta, uh, Regina, I've, I've done work around there uh, years ago doing geophysics. I spent a fair bit, I, I did a fair bit of work there, right? Um, I know those people, I know the Albertans, they're hard people, like hard working, right? Powerful people don't fuck with Canadians, man. True Canadians, you try to bully them around, they'll fucking stand their ground and hold the line. Right? Hold the line. Right. Fantastic. Let's light up a cigar. I didn't bring my cutter. I'm just going to bite it off. <laughs> Poor quiet woman get to wear high heels. Confuse people. <laughs> no, Elder God. 5'11". Five five. You're 5'5". Five five. <laughs> I'll be a giant next to you, brother. <laughs> Not really. You probably make me look like look small, so you're strong. Very happy, man. Very happy. Salute to Tamara Lynch. And all the truckers. Hong Kong. Gang, our little intro. What are we in? Half an hour in it. I think I loaded on everything. We're gonna go through the Speedy Gonzalez. Uh, only in height, only in height, indeed. Uh, I'm just gonna do this because um, we're not gonna load this up to censor two in its entirety, right? Uh, so we have to do this. I mean, they killed, censor two killed Scott Ritter's channel. <laughs> like, fucking incredible. And people keep on telling me, oh, Chicho, 
you know, how come you're not live streaming on SensorTube? How come you're not doing this? I'm, not the, I'm like, people, do you understand what is going on with censorship and technocrats and fascism and tyranny? Do you understand what is happening? Right? Very nice. How are you doing? What are we harvesting today? We're going to grab some grapes. Some of the grapes are ready. I put some grapes in the freezer. I'll bring some grapes from the freezer too. The real time C mic. Screw sensor tube. Indeed. Screw sensor tube. Getting on that note. We're on Patreon. Substack. Subscribe. Start. You can follow the work there. We have a Gilded server. You're definitely welcome to join us on Gilded. Join our little community. Communicate. Thank you very much for the tier one sub. Uh, MC Mike Hong Kong. Let me move this thing up. Where's, where's our browser thing? Gee, this guy needs to go up. Boop. New. Boop. New. Boop. <laughs> What's going on? There, I'm doing this. I'm messing around. Um, gang. If you are watching this intro this half an hour on sensor tube we can't load this full live stream on sensor tube i don't know what we're going to talk about but we just if we drop a word sensor tube might kill your channel without warnings they did it to scott ritter wow right so many people so if you want to full, watch the full live stream you can find it links in the description on bitch rumble and odyssey and we are live streaming on both Twitch and on Rumble. Most likely we're going to add other platforms that we're going to live stream on. We'll, we won't be live streaming on SensorTube. Okay. Because people have been asking me, why aren't you live streaming on SensorTube? Because SensorTube is run by fascists. And they'll nuke you for no reason. Right? So why would we risk getting the channel nuked? and it's a dying platform as far as i see it right so these channels we're on right now prowler ranger how are you doing if mr h was around today sensor tube would be his biggest platform mr h who's mr h h birdie here hope you're doing well i will stream a cooking stream on sensor tube i don't i don't want to I really don't. Uh, maybe. I don't know. We'll talk to the community gang. Let's talk on Gilded. If you guys think I should live stream on SensorTube, like a cooking stream or something, maybe. Oh, yeah. With Fiddler, Baby Knight. Yeah. He'd be on SensorTube. But Scott Ritter won't be. Right? Crazy. See, Death420. How are you doing? Yo, Chicho and all. Just to increase our numbers, yeah, we could we could definitely increase the numbers on if we live stream on sensor tube. There's no doubt about it, and we're shadow banned on sensor tube. Like you should see some of the videos I'm uploading. <laughs> we're back on for for like a couple, two or three days. The shadow ban was lifted, and our views went back to what they were. But they've been in shadow bans back on hard again this time, right? And you should see you should see the numbers on the views it's crazy we get more views on some of the videos on bitshoot where we have like a thousand eleven hundred followers than we do on sensor tube where we have like 30 34 000 followers right crazy crazy go rumble mc mike says prowler ranger the og nazi good to see you chicho good to see you as well brother been a while since i've caught a live stream glad to have you now we'll be doing this for a long time brother birdie here man if you don't like sensor tube and what what they doing then there is no reason to stream on there or support them that's exactly why i haven't been doing it because i don't want them to get any views right i rather people i rather we get less views and people watch our content on these platforms then get more views on sensor too I, I really don't want to support them right we do what we can we'll share as much content as we can which i feel comfortable with but no more okay prowler i don't want to use his name and get your channel flag. does it get flags crazy thank you prowler ranger 
<laughs> Pourquoi? Uh, you want to increase the numbers with zombies. That's most of what you'll get on Sensor 2. Yeah, probably. Probably. Lots of bots. Oh my god, I'm going to advertise the Rumble stream in some platforms. I am popular on awesome elder god <laughs> awesome and gang uh we do have a soundcloud page where we upload some of the audio as podcast i'll get back on it i'm pretty lazy on that one um i'll get back on it this fall uh try to uh, you know fine tune that deal uh we're on twitter we're on mines we're on gab we're on uh vk we're on soundcloud notes we're on uh getter i haven't loaded up the other one so we're on multiple platforms you can follow the work on multiple platforms join us participate in conversation gilded is a good place to be and gang if you're on sensor tube links everywhere else okay let me take these guys down and